Do you worry about having enough money to last throughout retirement? Give Reed Potter at Raymond James a call. Reed has 26 years experience helping folks enjoy their best life in their retirement years. As we move toward the winter season, snow and ice are sure to follow, and Pikeville Police Department has some advice on how to prepare. Defrosting your vehicle, avoiding ice on walkways, and simply being mindful of the weather forecast can all be helpful. Pikeville Police Captain Russell Blankenship tells us more. Just be mindful, maybe watch the weather the night before, get an idea of what the weather's going to be like for the next day. Um, get up and leave early enough so you have enough time to slow down, get there on time safely. Um, and before doing so, make sure you uh, defrost your car windows, maybe you scrape it. And slow down, make sure you're not falling too close, and watch out for black ice. Yeah, as soon as you step out the door, you know, you can't really see the ice on the steps or walkways, and I'm sure everybody sees these funny videos. It's all over the internet of people falling, but um, people actually receive serious injuries from those falls, so just be mindful of that also as soon as you walk out the door. It is also recommended that drivers check their tires before going onto any snowy roads. For those who don't want to drive in harsh conditions, carpooling is another option. Yes, yeah, it's the time of the year where you need to make sure you check your tires. It's um, very helpful when you're traveling in the snow. Um, even four-wheel drive vehicles, if your tires are, you know, the tread's very low, then your four-wheel drive is not going to be good at all. So just make sure you're checking your tires, and if you need to replace them, go ahead and try to replace them if you can. Also, if, you, if you're not comfortable driving and there's snow on the ground or maybe ice and you're just not comfortable with it, you can actually ride with somebody or... Just don't even chance it, just don't even make the trip. You maybe have to call in to work or see if you can ride with someone if maybe your vehicle's not equipped for the, the weather. Just make sure you try to call somebody, maybe catch a ride with them. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.